is it? You may well ask what it is. It's an acoustic bass guitar that has been modified by Richard Morgan from Portland. Portland, that's right, in Victoria. It's strung in octaves. The bottom string is C, octave, G, D, A. I think that's right, yes. So it's actually a cello, it's a mando cello in a way, but very long scale. Mando cellos not, not, aren't normally as big as this. But he's got a pickup on it. Sound like a, I guess, an octave mando cello. Chords are a little bit bigger than normal, but they sound bigger. instruments have you seen Jerry? I've never seen anything like this. Richard Morgan has made this top and put it onto a regular fairly uh, uh, well we don't know what it was because it's been changed but um, Richard Morgan is making these tops that are uh, pre-tensioned divergent timber soundboards. <laughs> That's what they are they're pre-tensioned divergent divergent timber sandboards. Sometimes King Billy Pine, sometimes Western Red Cedar, uh, he puts them under tension and then struts, puts the struts in. So they're, they're, it's an arch top, but it isn't carved, it's a pressed arch top uh, sandboard. Um, so yeah, um, and, uh, he, he does this to uh, mandolins. We have mandolins with this type of configuration and we have a guitar here that has that arch top configuration too. I think this for me is kind of the most startling one because it's just so big but Capo. 